Hey guys, thanks for checking out iDub. My name is Tyson and we're doing a quick review here of the Bauer Supreme Total One Ice Hockey Skate. Uh, this is gonna be the top of the line skate in the Supreme line. Um, it's gonna have an extremely lightweight design to it, which we'll go over in a bit. Um, but starting on the bottom with what uh, runner they're using on it, um, this is a new kind of breakthrough design. It's called the Fusion Runner. Um, basically what it is, is they've actually fused two different types of material. You have your traditional um, steel, stainless steel bottom runner. So that's gonna hold the edge um, just like a traditional runner will um, but then what they did is they went ahead and fused an aluminum material on the upper portion um, so you can kind of see the differentiating between the two as far as what one has printed on um, that's going to be the aluminum um, so that's going to significantly reduce the overall weight of the runner on it um, so that's going to add to the lightweight design of the skate um, this is an extremely lightweight skate and then as far as the um, holder on it this is going to be the two colder um, so that's going to be the time tested two colder um, which many people are already familiar with so they've gone ahead and used that on this guy um, taking a look on the outsole on it um, this is going to be a full composite outsole as you'd expect from the top line skate um, so it's going to offer a great rigidity as well as that lightweight feel um, so you're going to really have an excellent feel for that steel underneath your foot um, when you're skating um, going on from there, uh, taking a look at the quarter package used on it. Um, this is going to be Bauer's Alive material, um, which was also featured on the 195 skate. Um, this is going to offer what they're calling a 360 degree um, customized fit, and they're really pushing the customized fit on this skate um, to really almost offer that pro level performance um, that the pros get as far as customized skate on a retail version. So it's really nice to see from Bauer. Um, what it does is it has um, exceptional heat molding properties. Um, so when the skate breaks in and molds to your foot, um, it's really going to just form to exactly how your foot is. Um, you can really see on the back here how it has that um, very similar to a foot look to it. Um, so it's definitely going to hold the foot nicely um, as you go on. And also has a, has a nice kind of subtle look to the skate too. You have a little bit of that kind of composite look to it, but it's black, has a very traditional design. Um, then going on to the front, you see that same uh, toe cap that they've been using, which have gotten some pretty good reviews. Um, and then adding to the customized feature on the skate, which is another thing that really is going to differentiate this, is this is going to be one of the first skates that's going to allow you to customize the overall flex of that forward on the skate. Um, so basically right now we have a medium flex in there and they actually offer different um, little flexes or tongue flexes and they actually are calling this the reflex tongue. Um, so you'll actually have different options to choose how stiff you want that. So this is going to be just one example of an X stiff one. Um, the one in the skate is going to be a medium. Um, so to change them it's pretty easy. You just have to move the laces away at the bottom um, and then there's just going to be a little tab in here um, that you'll pull like that. And then the overall thing, you just kind of bend it and it pops out and then you can go ahead and replace that with your other one, depending on what preference you like of how stiff or how soft you like the flex of the boot. Um, so that's a nice customized feature um, that currently is not being offered by anyone else. Um, and then also as far as the rest of the tongue goes, um, they offer a nice contour design. Um, you can see here it has a nice rounded shape to it. It doesn't have a traditional felt uh, construction to it. Um, so it does have some foams in it. Um, it's not super, super thin, um, which I like. I like having a little bit of substance there, um, but it does have a low profile design. And then on the inside, you almost have a very similar to that felt. So it will ha have a similar feeling to it, um, but it isn't a traditional design. Um, going on from there, uh, take a look on the inside of the skate. Um, you can see it has a nice liner on there. Uh, it's going to wick away the moisture and really offer a nice traditional fit. And then upper on the upper portion of the skate, this is another feature um, that wasn't traditionally featured on retail skates. It was more of a pro exclusive. And that's just this kind of leather. It's called the comfort leather, leather just right on the top of it. And that's really going to kind of stop it from digging into the foot there. So it has a nice uh, soft feel to it. Uh, that's a nice small touch that was added onto this skate. Um, and then also going in to take a look at the overall uh, footbed on it. Um, now this footbed is going to be similar to what you've already seen from Bauer. Um, so that's going to be um, the super fit one. Um, basically they added that little rubber bit around there so you're going to have some good foot control. And then if you look at the bottom, um, one is, is a thin piece of foam, but then you also have these more um, rigid kind of composite type murals under the forefoot as well as under the heel. Um, so it's, it's not going to add much um, cushioning to the skate. Um, but really you don't want a lot of cushioning on there because you want to have a nice feel for the skate underneath your feet. Um, you want to know any little bumps or any little movement down there. You want to be feeling it. Um, so this is going to offer a great support as well as giving you a nice overall feel to the skate. And then kind of summarizing the skate, um, all in all they've done an excellent job at making this a customizable skate as well as making it extremely light. 
Um, I recently weighed this guy in, and this was I just weighed one uh, 8D skate, and that weighed in at um, just under 700 grams. So it was actually 691 grams. Um, so that's an extremely lightweight skate. Um, all the features from the runner to the materials they're using kind of added to that um, overall design. But I think they've done a great job on this. Um, once again, this has been a quick look at the Bauer Supreme Total One Ice Skate here at icewarehouse.com.